Hey you guys, it's Carrie Lenahan checking in from Salon Mar Salon today. So happy almost 4th of July and I'm going to start off with bang trim and then I'll go into the other stuff. Well actually no, I'm going to just say that I am feeling completely overwhelmed with the number of messages, text messages, <coughs> my phone has been blowing up all day. So thank you everybody for saying happy birthday, for reaching out, leaving little messages. I can't wait to get home and try them all out. I got to drive home. but. I'm gonna open one of my bottles of wine. I'll show you guys. I've been spoiled rotten today. So those are my flowers, a plant, candle, or wine, cookies. These earrings from my mother-in-law. How cute are these? They're like made from, they're like from Africa or whatever. They're like the little paper stuff. So anyway, so cute. So anyways, thank you. And I'm headed home to have dinner with my boys. They're making me dinner. So I've had a few people asking about bang trims and one of the girls at volleyball asked me last night, hi Jody, you made it on, yay. Jody was telling me this, my sister you guys, she is the hairdresser that inspired me to become a hairdresser. So, hey Jody. So anyway, we're gonna do a quick bang trim. I actually have been growing out my bangs, so I'm gonna fake a quick bang trim, but I had somebody at volleyball ask and then uh, someone today. So anyways, she's going to Europe. So what I'm gonna do, I could probably use a little cleanup. What you're gonna do is section out your bangs and bring forward the area. If you've never had bangs, it's a little trickier because then you're really creating the space and that would be a whole nother video. This is, I just saw Carrie a few weeks ago, 4th of July is happening, we're going to a barbecue and my bangs are right at me. So we're gonna take in the hair that's in this little front area. So we're gonna go from recession right there to recession. We're gonna bring this hair forward, actually, we're gonna do one thing at a time because we're doing it as if I am you guys at home. So we're gonna bring this hair forward into the center. What we wanna do is bring the hair together. Do you see how this is coming down in a V? What this is gonna do for us, this is called over, um, over, oh my gosh, I forgot the word. Anyway, overextending whatever, thank you, Jody. coming over. So what happens is, is because this hair is traveling further to this middle point, when we trim it, it's gonna fall longer. So this is gonna give you that nice little frame around on your fringe. And the trick to trimming your own bangs is to never come in and go whack, because that is trouble, unless you really know what you're doing. And some of you, yes, it probably works. But I'm just gonna clean up my ends. And generally, oh, it's kinda hard to see without the, uh, in the camera there. But the trick is, I'm just doing a little bit. If I were trimming my bangs, I would go up a little further. So what you're gonna do is pretend with me here you wanna stay out of the way a little bit so you have some room to work because if you're right down here, you're gonna cut your fingers. So you're gonna bring the hair over to the center area and down. So we're looking at the hair all coming into about a half inch section. It's flat, it's not round. I'm gonna bring the hair in. So if I'm trying to be super careful, what I'm gonna do is keep the shears very vertical and I'm just gonna come in. I was telling a guest today, she could do that three times in a row and it just lightens the ends without actually taking a lot of length. So if your bangs are just a little bit heavier, a little bit long, hi Kim, um, you could come in and come like this. And of course I would be coming in a little deeper if I were really cutting them. If you want to remove more length, then you're gonna come in at more of an angle and come across and chip away. That's gonna take more hair away. But once you've had your bangs cut and you're just trying to maintain them, I always tell my, my guests to keep a pair of scissors, even if it's just the little manicure scissors, you really can't screw too much up with those. Bring the hair in and every couple weeks, go ahead and just maintain them. It's like your eyebrows, ladies. Once you get them shaped, you wanna just tweeze them all the way along the way so they don't get out of control. So you bring in, you're gonna come in, point cut, I wish I had more hair to cut. Maybe I'll get some fake hair and pretend for you guys later. But coming in, point cutting in, take them down, shake them. Oh, they're still a little bit long. Do the same thing. Like I said, I'm not cutting my bangs, so I'm unfortunately not a very good model for you guys. But I just wanted to kind of give you that little trip. The key is point cutting. It's very forgiving. So, okay, it looks like my network is about to tap out. So anyways, peace out. Love you guys. Good to see you, Jody. I'm here. And uh, thank you again for all of the amazing birthday wishes. Peace out. Later, go forth and radiate.